Good morning, it's Tuesday the 28th of May 2024 and we are here at Walt Disney World and today we're going to Magic Kingdom. We're so excited. Yeah. Traditionally Magic Kingdom is our first full day park yeah. but um, with it being Memorial Day yesterday we just we couldn't face Magic Kingdom straight away yeah. so we, we just figured it was going to be way too busy. Um, we are trying to avoid having Genie Plus, yeah. so um, we thought that Animal Kingdom was probably the way to go for yesterday and it actually turned out quite well for us, didn't yeah, it? Yeah, it really did. We had the best day. Uh, looking forward to strolling down Main Street and seeing the castle Can't today. Um, and we are hoping to catch the parade and happily ever after and uh, ride some of our favourite rides. Um, Having said that, we did manage to get a boarding group for Tron this morning on the virtual queue. Um, so we're super excited about that. I literally, from from pressing refresh at seven o'clock um, to pressing the button to join, it was about five seconds and we're still like group 47 or something like that. Yeah. So it is just amazing how it works um, and how quick you have to be. Uh, but yay, we managed to get it. So hopefully we will be ready in Tron today. Um, it has given a thunderstorm later this afternoon. So, uh, but fingers crossed, it looks like it's at the time um, where we'll probably come back to the, the resort anyway, because we do like a split day. So hopefully that all works out. Uh, yeah, but before we go, we'll show you what we decided to wear today. So today I'm wearing this cake worthy dress, which was from Truffle Shuffle. Uh, I'm taking my Stitch Lounge fly bag today and I'm wearing my goofy Adidas trainers and wearing the Briar Rose Gold ears, which um, I think that these are um, Disney Parks ones um, and they just go with everything. So this t-shirt was a Sainsbury's one, um, the shorts were from H&M quite a while ago. Um, I've gone for my trusty June sandals today because I did have my sketches on yesterday and I'm kind of trying to alternate. Uh, the bag is a Shop Disney one um, and I've kind of gone matching with my um, sort of pale blue ears today. Um, so yeah, we're still, we're not taking any jumpers, cardigans, anything. So it's way too hot for that, isn't it? Super hot. So we're not even taking a backup. We are going to take our Kath Kidston um, Rain Max though, um, just in case we aren't out of there before the storm comes. Um, but we are ready to go. Um, it's an hour until the park opens for resort guests. So we've got loads of time. So we're going to head down to the bus. Um, hopefully there'll be one soon. And we'll be in Magic Kingdom for road drop. So we 
we've just had a walk down Main Street. It was quite a busy one, so we might do it again later with less people. Uh, we've been to Starbucks and grabbed a drink, and now we're in the park by the castle. Um, it's uh, quarter to nine, and the welcome show starts at five. So we're going to hang around here, watch the welcome show, and then we're going to decide whether we're going to go to Tomorrowland or Adventureland. We're not too sure. Yeah. we ever went on in uh, Disney World so uh, it's really nice to start with that one. Um, I managed to drop my lens cap in the water as well uh, from a camera um, but luckily the cast member Chris uh, managed to get it out for me. It was so nice. Oh, my heart's beating so fast I was panicking but um, yeah um, he managed to get this like big grabber thing and get it out uh, so that was really kind. Um, and yeah uh, we're in Adventureland. Um, Pirates? Pirates, yeah, pirates. <laughs> we used to pirate adventure. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting about that. What time is it open? I think it's 11, but we'll have to chat when we go towards Winter <laughs> Boat. No. <laughs> You're dry, it's fine, it's boiling. 
Um, shall we go and see what the wait time's like for Jungle Cruise? Yes. I think it was the last time I checked on the app, it was 45 minutes, so that's not that's too okay. bad. It's definitely going to get longer than that yeah. today. I'm not ruling out the tiki room when we need a bit of aircon later. Oh no, I think it's the tiki room kind of day yeah. today. People are already in there. Now we got all sorts of animals here. We got stripy horses. Horses with horns. Some really tall horses. And the great things are new. And you know what? Those lions look happy. They have their favorite meal, stripy horse on the rocks. And they told me they're not hurting it. They're watching it while it sleeps. They're lying. <laughs> the guy on the bottom there is Skipper Felix. Now, Felix and I had a disagreement the other day. I told him that a rhino could outrun a safari on foot. He told me I didn't know what I was talking about. But you know what? I think he's going to get the point. Now, when we do pull in the dock and you start exiting the boat, if you notice that your shoes are filling up with water, you got out on the wrong side. Get back in and try again. <laughs> Any children left behind after midnight become property of the Walt Disney Company. We take them to Small World, bolt their shoes to the floor, and teach them that song in 37 languages. <laughs> now, if you happen to have some older kids you're looking to, uh, what's that word, rehome, we got you covered there too. That's right. We'll teach them how to drive boats and tell bad jokes. Hi. Now, when we pull in the dock here, these fine skippers are going to help you out of the boat the best way they know how. You're on your own. <laughs> you know that Small World thing I was telling you about? Skipper Trey was a little guy up in the balloon waving for years. <laughs> so we did wait quite a long time for Jungle Cruise. Um, it said it was going to be 45 minutes and then in the end it probably worked out about 70? Probably seven, between 70 and 80 minutes. Um, I'm not sure if they were having technical issues or what happened there. Um, but yeah, it was quite a long time in the queue, wasn't it? It was, um, but it was absolutely worth it. Yeah. We had a really, really good uh, jungle cruise and our skipper was fantastic. Uh, he was, his name was Chuck. And uh, yeah, the jokes, we hadn't heard a lot of them before. Um, he was really funny and really cool. So yeah. uh, it kind of made it worthwhile, uh, even though we did wait a long time. Um, the wait times have obviously crept up already and we are trying not to have Genie Plus um, today. Uh, so we are going to see what else we can do. We're going to go and try and find some food. Uh, we might just get a quick snack and then um, yeah, we might have it head over to Fantasyland because that's where the wait times are coming down a little bit. So we're going to try there next. Oh my gosh, how good is Oh, it looks so good. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, I can't wait for it to be open. Uh, Westwood Ho and we're gonna try the candy bacon skewer um, yeah it's bacon skewer and then it came with um, these chips but they do contain milk so we can't have these but I'm hoping this is gonna be super tasty and um, it was $10 something for this uh, but yeah definitely a good uh, chance to get some protein while I'm in the parks <laughs> So second snack, uh, we've never actually had one of these. No. Um, they've got a bit of a bad rep, but we were actually recommended um, to try one. So we're going to give it a go. This is from the Liberty Market and it was 14 37 including tax. Um, but it's absolutely massive. Yeah, it's pretty big. That's so, a big um, turkey. <laughs> so we'll let you know how we get on with it anyway. To the top of Main Street, uh, we ate a snack. Yeah. What do you think of the bacon? I really like the candy bacon. I thought it was delicious. It wasn't very big, especially for the price, but it was pretty tasty. I really liked it. Yeah. The turkey leg um, was not that great. It was massive. Yeah. But um, it kind of tasted like I would say it was more like a ham than a turkey. Yeah. Um, wasn't that great and again like quite expensive. I think it was like fourteen yeah. dollars. So probably won't be having that again. You get yeah. the bacon again? Yeah, maybe the bacon again. Um, so we are waiting for the parade now. Um, it's actually being shown at 12 as well as 3. So we're going to try and catch the early one if we can. But we are still waiting for our Tron boarding group as well. So we need to keep our eye on the app. 
they are. Hopefully gonna call us, I would say probably in the next hour or so. I would say so. So um, we need to keep our eye on that as well. But it's getting super hot, so I think we might find a little bit of shade, um, hopefully before the parade comes by, and um, then we'll be ready. I'm so excited for the first one.
great grade. This amazing. Was amazing. Yeah. Like, so many characters waving and posing for pictures and video and stuff. It was so cool. And literally, there was nobody around us at all. No. We sat on a bench for until the first float was coming before we even stood up. Yeah, that was amazing. Crazy. Yeah, it was so good. Um, yeah, and then to top it off, our boarding group's just been called for Tron. Yay! <laughs> so we're gonna head over to Tomorrowland now and uh, get on Tron. Then we might go for a little break. Um, and then, yeah, we'll come back and maybe um, do some more rides, maybe watch some friendship fair. Just have big, honestly, Minnie was right this morning. It's the best, best day, day ever. ever. <laughs> yeah. So after we watched uh, the Dapper Dance um, 
on Main Street we went past the resort and and we've come back in now and come straight to Columbia Harbour House we're starving there. Yeah. And um, we have the mobile order, which is a lot of personal time, so just getting in the normal queue. Um, I also need to go and pay on the app as well. So we have gone for kids meals. Um, this is the shrimp skewer with rice and green beans. And I went for the grilled salmon, the rice and green beans. Yeah, and because they are they are kids meals, we also got a drink and food as well, so we both went for lemonade. Yeah. Um, we're going to have this, we're not too sure what else we're going to do. Wait till it's still see quite high, considering it's now just after seven. Um, but I'm happy ever after it, it's quite nice, we need to make sure we get a good spot for that as well. Okay. Yeah. This squirrel is trying to steal my... Uh, Cinnamon glazed pecans. We were sitting on that bench. <laughs> it got a bit too close to comfort. I've never been this close to a squirrel before ever. So uh, yeah, it's nice to have a friendly squirrel, but you can't mug me for my delicious pecans. <laughs> Aww. <laughs>
as well. In Magic Kingdom today. Yeah, it felt um, really dark. Yeah, we were going to finish the vlog there, but um, but yeah, we couldn't find anywhere light enough to do it. So we're back in the room. Um, the journey back did take a little while just because we had to wait quite a while for our bus. Yeah. Um, but we are still back by 11 o'clock, which isn't too bad. Yeah, we um, obviously we, we had some food and then we just went for a nice walk. Uh, Big Thunder Mountain was down, we really wanted to ride it, mm -hmm. um, but it was down. So we went and did uh, Mickey's Philhar Magic instead, which is one of our favorite things to do anyway. And then we waited for the fireworks, which were amazing. Yeah, so good. Yeah. And they'd already started letting people sort of on the road in front of the castle. And um, so we just found a little spot. Um, yeah. Buy some bins, which is, Sounds not great, but it's really useful because it means that no one can stand directly in front of you. Yeah, it does give you a little bit of space. Um, and yeah, happily ever after, just the best fireworks ever. Oh, it was amazing. It was yeah. just so nice. Um, and then because they were on at 9.20 and they only last around about 20 minutes, we still had time yeah. for Big Thunder Mountain, which is back on. Um, and it's always really cool in the dark, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, we, we walked over there thinking everyone was probably going to do that. And then we waited. We probably, it took us three minutes to walk through the queue and then we waited another three minutes so literally six minutes we were yeah. on big thunder mountain pretty much a walk yeah and then we decided to to head back because it was closed at 10 o'clock um favorites from today oh um i think it was the parade yeah our interactions were so good we didn't even really get a spot for it. I think it definitely helps because they are doing two showings at the moment. Mm -hmm. So we went to the 12 o'clock one and instead of um, trying to squeeze in on a spot down the main street or over in Frontierland, um, we just came all the way back up to sort of the entrance. Yeah. And it's, there was 
literally no one next to us. Yeah, there was there was so much space. Um, we've chosen that area quite a few times, but we've never chosen that side before. Um, and yeah, it was incredible. You probably had more room and a better view there than you would in any viewing area. Yeah. So, um, so yeah, and we got amazing interactions by lots and lots of characters as well. It was kind of a little bit surreal and it went super fast. Uh, just like today really. Yeah, the whole day has gone really quick and um, it definitely was worth coming back for a little break in between It just gets so so hot. Yeah, Um that to try and do all day is just I mean We just saw lots of very tired hot people didn't yeah. we? Yeah, it does get a lot doesn't it? But um, we did the day also without Genie Plus and we still managed to get on like six rides and attractions and do the parade and the fireworks and the welcome show uh, and have a break in between and just not rush anywhere like we had like a you know a long uh, dinner at Columbia Harbour House and we just took it really really easy so uh, we still got plenty done even though we didn't have Genie Plus. Uh, tomorrow Hollywood Studios. Yeah, we're going to Hollywood Studios tomorrow. Um, it's time for uh, Toy Story Mania, which we just look forward to all the time when we're at home. We just can't wait to play that. Uh, Frozen Sing Along. Oh, I love that so much. Uh, we are going to try and rope dog and see if we can get on Slinky Dog because, again, we're trying not to get Genie Plus. So um, we are going to have to get up early and uh, get in that queue. Um, and yeah, uh, we're hoping also to watch Fantasmic, which is literally one of our favourite things ever in Walt Disney World and anywhere. We absolutely love it, so we just cannot wait for that. There's also two showings of that, so we'll have to see which one we decide to go to. Um, but yeah, we're just super excited for another great day. Uh, that will be next week's vlog if you are interested. And if you have enjoyed this video, please do give it a like. And if you're not already subscribed, <clears throat> then please do uh, and check out our other videos as well. Thanks for watching. Have a magical day.